regarding is there any provision in the current bill? Sir, could I get your, your name and hometown first? Sure. Charlie Burke, you win. Thanks, Charlie. Okay. My question regards the confusion over the current bill. Is there any provision in it to exclude abortion and euthanasia coverage? Yes. In fact, I voted on that on July 31st, Charlie. It's in the bill. It was an amendment we voted on. It preserves the language of the Hyde Amendment, which says that no federal money can be used to pay for abortion services. It also improved, includes the language of the Weldon Amendment, which says that no pro-life doctor or hospital or insurance plan can be required to participate in providing abortion services. Both of that language is included in the House bill. You also mentioned euthanasia, and I want to talk about that because that's come up in the context of this pull the plug on grandma claim. I want to make sure you know exactly where to find that because that was also part of the language included in the Blue Dog Amendment that we adopted on July 31st. Here's what it says. None of the end of life planning shall promote suicide, assisted suicide, or the active hastening of death. I'm reading right from the bill. It shall not presume the withdrawal of treatment and shall include end of life planning information that includes options to maintain all or most medical interventions. Nothing shall be construed to require an individual to complete an advanced directive or encourage the hastening of death or the promotion of assisted suicide. And then it says in big, bold, capital letters, prohibition on the promotion of assisted suicide. It shall not include as an option suicide, assisted suicide, or the intentional hastening of death, regardless of lethality. That's in the bill I voted on. Thank you.